What is up, everyone? Happy Thursday. It's Thursday, July 13th, 2023. And small red day today. It's 131. Didn't didn't have many trades. Wasn't a lot of action going on. Um, started off with an MU, just a small winner on a volume runner, and then Microsoft continuation, pretty much a scratch trade. And then this this Tesla uh, kind of played it as a mighty 90 minus 230. Show you what I did here. Uh, first off, MU. So it had this big volume bar, and when it popped up to here, um, I got in before this bar closed. And then when it it came down somewhere down here towards the bottom, um, I didn't get filled. I thought I was going to get filled. It popped up, and then it came back down, and it filled me the second time. Um, and then it ended up popping up and I ended up cutting it somewhere in here because I just didn't like the price. Actually, I think it was this one right here after this bar, this bar came down, but it wouldn't come down anymore. I really wanted it to roll over. And when it didn't come down anymore, I just cut it right in here. It was, you can see that was a good out. So that's why I was a small winner. Microsoft. So Microsoft had this pullback here and then um, I got long. And it, when it popped up, I got out of half, and then it came down. And then when it pushed through here, I just cut it. And you can see it kind of chopped. So on the continuation runner, you want the pullback, you know, right here. Then you get long, and I wanted this to continue up. And when it came back down, I cut it. This is pretty much a scratch trade. And then Tesla kind of played it as a mighty 90 um, right here. And then when it came down to here, I added to it. And then it came down even more against me. And this is where people are asking me, do you cut it? Do you hold? And I say, I'm, I'm holding, you know, so I get two green bars. And so it did it pushed up here. I actually left it on. I posted this in the chat. Normally I would have closed it right here. Um, this, I wanted to see if it would do this to maybe I get a little more back. Um, but uh, it started to look like it may come down. I gave it two minutes in this bar, and it was red, so I cut it right there. You can see what happened. It popped back up. So definitely would have got more than – I probably got at least half of my position back. I don't I don't like to look at my P&L in the middle of a trade, but uh, I bet I got half of it back at least waiting for two green bars. So, um, you know, instead of maybe minus 500 or something like that, it's minus 230. So you want to keep your losses small. So um, minus 131. Yeah, I'll take that. And it was pretty muted price action on a lot of the stocks I day trade today. So that's why there wasn't a lot of opportunities. I did miss a good one in Google. I'll show you real quick, though, just so you can learn. Um, I, I, I saw this here. The markets were strong. It pushed up. When it pulled back here. I noticed it came down to this pivot and it started to pop. I was wanting to get in right here, but then this popped up really quick on me and you can see what it did. But this was, I was trying to get in on this, a continuation runner to the upside. It would have been a real big winner. Um, it's unfortunate. I could have been a green day if I got in on that one. But um, anyway, um, Steve will be with you guys tomorrow and Monday. So I'll see everybody back on Tuesday. Talk to you later. Peace.